Most visible in the darkness of night, legends suggest that these bright dancing lights might be spirits, omens, or dragons in the sky. Known as Aurora Borealis in the north and Aurora Australis in the south, this colorful exhibition is actually the result of collisions between charged particles from the sun and atoms that they encounter as they enter the Earth's atmosphere. Disturbances associated with magnetism in sunspot regions, called coronal mass ejections, or solar flares, allow free electrons, protons, and alpha particles to boil off into space in all directions from the sun, forming the solar wind. Most of the solar wind-charged particles reaching Earth are deflected by Earth's magnetosphere. However, near the polar regions, because of the geometry of the Earth's magnetic field, they spiral into Earth's atmosphere due to the magnetic force that acts on a charged particle moving through a magnetic field. The direction of that force can be found using the right-hand rule. The magnetic force can be computed from when these charged particles strike atoms in Earth's atmosphere, they cause electrons in the atoms to move to a higher energy state. When the electrons drop back to a lower energy state, they release photons, small bursts of energy in the form of light. And the night sky becomes a canvas painted with glowing lights. The colors created depend on which gas is being excited by the charged particles and on how much energy is being exchanged. Whether you're enticed by legend or by curiosity, the auroras are a spectacular sight to behold.